Hello everyone. Welcome to Engineering Graphics through CAD Laboratory. I am Rakesh Valsa. In this video lecture, I am going to explain one problem in projections of points. Let us see the given problem. A point capital P is 50 mm from both the reference planes. Draw its projections in all possible positions. That means the point in first coordinate, second coordinate, third and fourth coordinate. Let us see the solution for the given problem. Let us assume the point in first coordinate. That means 50 mm above the HP and 50 mm in front of the VP. That means the front view is 50 mm above the HP and top view 50 mm below the XY. The second coordinate that means uh, the point P 50 mm above the HP and 50 mm behind the VP. In the second coordinate, both front view top view are above the XY because uh, the top view falls on horizontal plane. When we rotate a horizontal plane in 90 degrees clockwise direction, so the top view goes above the XY XY line. See the third coordinate. The point is 50 mm below the XY and 50 mm behind the VP. Here, front view is below the XY line and top view is above the XY line. That means the top view point projection falls on horizontal plane. When we rotate horizontal plane in 90 degrees clockwise direction, that point goes to above XY line. Similarly. Fourth coordinate, the point P, 50 mm below the XY, uh, 50 mm below the HP, and 50 mm in front of the VP. Here, both front view top view are coincide and uh, below the XY. Let us see how to draw this uh, given problem in AutoCAD software. First, open new drawing sheet. Now, turn off grid lines. Okay, before going to draw that problem in this new drawing sheet, let us do few important settings. First one is units, UN enter. Uh, precision is zero and uh, units to scale inserted content millimeter. Then click on OK. Second one, dimension style manager, D enter. Click on modify. First move to the lines. Here, extend beyond the dimension line. That means this one. Take 2 mm and uh, offset from origin. You can see it. This one is. I am taking 2 mm. You can see the. Uh, uh, you can see the difference in this template. Otherwise, you can take this one is one. Yes. Next. Uh, next, move to the. Symbols and arrows. Uh, arrow size. I am taking 3 mm. Next, move to the text. Click on text style. Uh, you need to click on these three dots and change the font name. Here, I am taking Times New Roman T I M E S Times New Roman. Font uh, font height is I am taking 3 mm. Set current. The current style has been modified. Do you want to save your changes? Yes. Then close this window. Here, just ensure that text placement vertically is above and horizontally centered or not. Next, move the text alignment that is ISO standard. Then click on OK. Uh, next, move the primary units. Here, precision I am taking zero. Then click on OK. Set current. Then close this window. Next one is object snap. O is enter. Select all. Just ensure all the options are selected or not. Otherwise, you can click on select all. Then click OK. Next, uh, Limax. L I M M E X. This is our drawing sheet size. Enter. Take A4 size. So that's why I am taking 297 comma 210. Enter. Next, uh, when you 
uh, scrolling your mouse this xy moves uh, uh, arrow in the screen that's why we are fixing uh, one command is ucs icon ucs icon enter no origin n enter the last setting is zoom setting z enter a enter okay now copy the question here just uh, select this text by double click on this window copy this text and paste in new our new drawing sheet control v here uh, here uh, uh, before going to draw the excellent bust uh, uh, i have given the distance between uh, projection of lines that means uh, uh, the gap between any two projectors i have taken that is 25 mm so from x to this first coordinate 25 first coordinate to second coordinate 25 second coordinate to third coordinate 25 third to fourth 25 fourth to x y 25 so total 125 mm first draw the line length is 125 by using line command l enter uh, turn on ortho mode f8 uh, 125 enter next uh, locate the x uh, locate the x x y points take text command t enter just drag here okay type small x then click on okay other end uh, type y y okay now divide this line into uh, five equal parts d i v d i v enter select object uh, enter the number of sides i am taking five then click enter uh, i have divided this line into five equal parts but it is not visible so that's why i am using one more com one more important command that is point style ddp type ddp type enter ddp type enter here i am using uh, this symbol uh, fourth one uh, then click on okay you can see here now you can is you can easily see the division of that line this is the first first point second point third point fourth point okay in that four points i need to construct a four uh, four different coordinate different coordinates so the first coordinate is uh, now the now a point is now the point is uh, here point name is p now the p point is in first coordinate that means uh, 50 mm above the hp and 50 mm in front of vp blindly you can remember that here above or below below indicates front view and behind in front indicates top view take line command 50 mm above the hp 50 enter uh, just you can move this text to m enter follow this one yes uh, this name is t enter this name is a dash uh, the point name is p p dash click on okay next uh, 50 mm in front of vp that means top view goes to below xy take line command l enter from this point draw the 50 mm 50 enter this name is p text command t enter okay draw the name a a that is uh, p here the front view is p dash and the top view is p now give the dimensions d l i enter first point this is 50 and uh, this is 50 uh, you can give the dimensions like uh, uh, this both are in same vertical line this is regarding first coordinate let us move to the second coordinate here second coordinate means the point p 
సేమ్ ఫిఫ్టీ ఎంఎం అబో ద హెచ్పి అండ్ ఫిఫ్టీ ఎంఎం బిహైండ్ ద బిపి ఐ హ్యావ్ క్లియర్లీ మెన్షన్ దట్ అబో ద హెచ్పి మీన్స్ ఆల్వేస్ యూ కెన్ డ్రా ద వర్ వర్టికల్ అండ్ దట్ ఈస్ అబో ద ఎక్స్ వై దట్ పాయింట్ షుడ్ బి అబో ద ఎక్స్ వై హౌ మచ్ దట్ లెంత్ ఫిఫ్టీ ఎంఎం టేక్ లైన్ కమాండ్ ఫ్రమ్ సెకండ్ పాయింట్ డ్రా ద ఫిఫ్టీ ఎంఎం లైన్ దిస్ నేమ్ ఇస్ పీ డాష్ This is front view and top view falls on horizontal plane. Now rotate that uh, horizontal plane in 90 degrees clockwise direction that point goes to above xy. Here top view and uh, uh, front view both uh, uh, distance are same. So that's why both front view and top view are coincident. So this point is also top view. You can also write P point. okay give the dimension dli linear dimension first point second point let us see the third coordinate uh, how to tell uh, the point in third coordinate the point p 50 mm below the hp and 50 mm behind the vp uh, here one important logic is there already above means above the xy below means below the xy that is front view take line command l enter from third point draw the 50 mm below the xy this is front view point point name is b dash take text command t enter p dash uh, what about top view the top view falls on horizontal plane now rotate that horizontal plane in 90 degrees clockwise direction that point goes to above the xy from this point draw the 50 mm line that is above the xy this name is t a uh, p top view name is p uh, next give the dimension d l i first point end point that means second point give the dimension to the left side first point second point both are in same vertical line next fourth coordinate that means point p 50 mm below the horizontal plane and 50 mm in front of bp we know that below means front view is below xy take line command from this point dollar 50 mm below 50 enter this is p dash now give the name p dash what about top view the top view falls on horizontal plane now rotate that horizontal plane in 90 degrees clockwise direction that point goes to below xy so here the both distance are same so front view top view are coincident and the both points are lies in below the xy you can also write p point here yes now give the dimension d l i enter t m m okay this topic is regarding uh, points that's why uh, we need to mention uh, points at front view on top view for that i am using donut d o enter specify inside diameter is i am taking 0 enter specify outside diameter i am taking 2 then click enter uh, here one point p dash and p for first coordinate next move to second coordinate both front view top here coincide next third uh, top for third coordinate p dash front view and p is top view in the fourth coordinate both front view top here coincide yes now turn up that point style ddp type enter now change points from this uh, 
dash to dot point then click on ok uh, now one more uh, correction is there the extension line should not be touched with this point that's why go to the dimension style manager d enter d enter click on modify move to the lines here offset from origin i'm taking 2 mm then click on ok set current then close this window you can see it now this extension line is uh, not touch with this point now you can copy that uh, take, uh, title block and paste here ok select this title block Okay, copy to here and delete this problem. Okay, okay, I already I have created this title block. Now copy this title block from this drawing sheet to uh, this drawing one sheet. Paste here, Control V. copy this title block control c and paste in drawing one yes uh, you can turn on turn on line weight mm -hmm. yes this is the solution for the given problem in projections of points you can also adjust this text by dra uh, drag this triangle Uh, you can also mention the coordinates here by using text command this is q1 coordinate 1 next uh, this is q2 just you can copy this coordinate c o enter this is 2 next 3 and 4 now edit the, edit the text this is q2 that means second coordinate <coughs> this is third coordinate this you can double click on this text then you can edit, edit the text q4 then click on ok ok after completion of this uh, solution uh, you, you need to convert this drawing file into pdf control p printer name is microsoft uh, print to pdf uh, this is paper size a4 correct center the plot drawing orientation landscape next uh, what to plot here you need to choose a window uh, this is my start point and this is my end point now click on apply to layout then click preview yes okay after filling these details that means title means projections of points name means your name your role number experiment number 2 and uh, date is today's date 22 9 2024 then click on plot uh, file name is uh, you can give your uh, own file name save as type pdf then click on save okay this is the procedure to save the drawing file into pdf in autocad software Okay, I hope this problem is very clear to everyone. Thank you for watching. Please do like and subscribe my channel for more updates.